Hello friends, welcome back to Dash of Spices. Today we are going to unbox this Kasori Dual Blaze 6.8 Quartz Air Fryer. I am super excited. Um, I have reached out to Kasori if I could test one of their product and this one was sent to me. You could also look this up in Amazon. I provided the link down below. Um, so far it has a good review. Also, it is a smart appliances so you could control this over an app echo dot or amazon alexa app and also the vsync app which you could download at the app store so check out the link down below i provided down below and there's a 20 dollar coupon that they also um provided using that amazon link and i'm just so excited and let's start unboxing so here we are, we're unboxing the Kusori Air Fryer Dual Blaze. Um, first impression, the box is not so exciting like the other one. The first one, it was so colorful, I guess, something to do with the packaging, you know. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I get so excited when there's a lot of colors. That's just me. So with this, it comes with this user manual. And um, that's about it. There's no recipe, oh bummer. Um, I always brag about the Kasori because they always include a nice, thick, um, nice uh, recipe. So this one doesn't come with it. So just a heads up. And this is the crisper plate. Um, definitely different from the other one. So here is the entire unit. I like it so far. It looks fancier. <laughs> um, it looks like it's well built. It's heavy. And this is the back side of it. The power is attached to the unit, which is good, the same as the other one. And we're just going to remove all the tape from this unit, and so we could check out the inside of it. So here's the inside of it. It comes with this nonstick bucket. It's way different from the old one, because the old one comes with the basket as well. So um, that's probably what the crisper plate is, the replacement for that basket. So definitely this one is a little bit bigger, well, way bigger than this one. This is my old 5.8 quartz Kasori. And this is the new one that Kasori sent me. Um, let's turn this on. By the way, when you turn it on, it um, default to air fry 360, 10 minutes. And then here, 350, 15 minutes. You notice that the time here is a little bit longer but the um, temperature is lower and here is 360 and temperature is 10 versus 15. I think maybe because it comes with dual burner basically you have the one on the top on the bottom so this probably help when you're cooking something and you don't have to flip it on the other side you know because on the old one you only have that on the top not in the bottom so you kind of want to flip if you're cooking something on this the old one with the new one there's a bottom burner and then a top burner and let me just compare this again this is the brand new one and this is the that's the 6.8 and this is the 5.8 or 5.6 um, this definitely comes with the basket, which I do like because you could just grab, if you're making specially vegetable, you could just grab this basket and dump it to a serving plate. Well, this one, it comes with this crisper. The crisper does have like, um, a rubber on the side. So let's see how long that rubber is going to last, right? But you could just remove it and then place it so but then you don't have to um you probably could use just a basket to cook something but i like to use i mean the basket without this crisper to cook like a meat or something but right here with this one when i'm cooking like a steak i like to use this basket the crisper basket we call this a crisper basket now so the oil will drip and i think i'm gonna do this here too um, when I cook some meat because I like the, the the oil that's the whole purpose of having air fryer is to separate 
um, the oil from the meat it's it actually more uh, it's better I mean for me I'm just talking for myself but yeah so that's the difference as you could see that's the old one that's the new one this is a little bit this is heavier and I like the handle because I know if you have a Kasori air fryer the older version like this one this will snap at some point because I had mine uh, Kasori sent me a free basket because my older one actually um, uh, it got separated it, it broke so this right here it broke so as you can see this one you definitely can see that they improve um, whoever built this have that idea maybe from the customer complaining about it which is good that's good that Kasori uh, took notes of the customer's review because this is one of the issue it breaks so that's good and then see it comes with 12 um oops sorry it comes with a 12 uh, function you got the chicken you got the steak seafood veggies i think the only difference is it has a well the roast and the broil i think because if you go here the old air because sorry air fryer just turn it on i think the bake is the cake and here their bake is a bake which is a word so people should be should know now what is this it's like oh what's that cake for on the older kasori um the this 5.8 um the cake is the bake here it shows the word bake so that less confusing right but as you can see the bake here is 320 320 for 20 minutes only well, right here it's 300 degrees for 30 minutes so as you can see it's less time here again maybe because of the dual i like the color it's fancier i think it still matches my my kitchen equipment um my kitchen appliances will kind of do like black and gray or silver and it's bigger it's taller it's wider and um yeah i kind of i like it and in the bottom the blade is actually thicker so you get more breathing right there compared to the older one um see that's all you you got right there but this had been good i mean i like this one but yeah it's nice to have a brand new uh again um shout out to kasori um, company for sending me this um, actually requested if I could review a new Kasori um, air fryer and they sent me this which I'm really grateful and thankful for that and yeah you're gonna see me making videos but this video is just unboxing and I'm just trying to compare what the new version is offers what's the new features this comes with um, Wi-Fi so we're gonna install that. I'm gonna show you how we install that. This doesn't come with it. And this new one you could control over Echo Dot or Amazon Alexa app. And also that VSync app, which I'm gonna show you here how to download it and how to set it up. Just like the normal app, I have an Apple uh, phone. So you just go to the app store and search for that vsync app i already downloaded it so all i have to do is open it you have to set up your account provide your email address and once that's done you click that add device and search for your device which is the kasori dual make sure that you're in front of the device add the device by powering the power button but hold it until you see that flashing wi-fi icon in the unit right there that means that means it's trying to communicate to your phone course now that it's set up right there that your phone is trying to communicate in the device all you have to do is join your home wi-fi and once that's set up all you have to do now is create a profile for your device so i just put it on a kitchen as a location and then you could name it however you want to name it i just name mine into a kasori 6.8 
just a basic so I don't have to get confused what unit is it. I definitely like this app. This app comes with recipes and also it already have functions like um, preset functions. So now you could start using the app remotely. You could also do Alexa and Echo Dot if you want to do this. Um, but I'll skip that for now. Um, so the apps again, all you have to do is click that start cooking and it provides you the temperature and the time. And then once you set your temperature and desired time, all you have to do is hit that start cooking. But then you have to be in front of the unit because you have to confirm it in the unit that you really want to cook this temperature and time. So that kind of beats the purpose of having an app because you still have to be right there in the unit. The only thing about this app is you could go anywhere outside or probably in your living room or your kitchen or the bathroom and you can monitor how many um, time left of your cooking. So that's the benefit of this. And you could stop the cooking through your phone, through that app. So again, this is a good app. Uh, it works um, uh, downloading it. It has some great recipes. The only downfall I get again is do you have to be in front of the unit to confirm the settings, which is actually good, I think. Um, so again, download this app, it's pretty cool. So I went ahead and rinsed this off because I'm gonna try it with making, um, oh, that's easy to close to. See, that's, that's good. I'm gonna try on making some green beans. Um, so in the old, old Kazori air fryer, it takes about five minutes to there's no preheat button but there's a reheat so we're just gonna do the reheat so and the other one the old one has a preheat button so this is says preheat reheat the other one is says preheat so I'm just gonna reheat that probably just a preheat um, it's not really that loud it's the same but a little louder maybe because it's a bigger unit and it has more like, again, more air flow on the back. You could definitely feel it. So this is just a paper towel. As you can see, that's the air from the back. It does produce a high air out. So that's a good idea. That's a good thing, right? So this is the back of it. This is the... Um, 6.8 and this is the 5.8 so that's the difference from the back oh I also like the top of it but maybe the food will get into here this one <laughs> it's hard to clean as you could see so that's good that they also pay attention to that design and change it because what is the need of that what is the need of those so that's good that they don't have it here that's a good one so I ended up making a green beans on an air fryer and used the preset button. So far it cooks the green beans, green beans perfectly and I didn't have to flip it on the other side. So I guess that's the benefit of having the dual blaze, the two burner because it's co it cooks the bottom and the top. So, so far this is good. I do like it. It's bigger unit. i um, excited to make more videos. I'm going to a video of how a separate video of how I made air fry green beans in this new 6.8 Kusori dual blaze air fryer grab yourself one again check out the description box there's a link there for Amazon link and this is a good unit it worth investing it they're gonna have Kusori is gonna have a Black Friday um, sale so check that out check their website or check the Amazon as well Thank you everyone for watching. I hope this video gave you a little idea if it worth it to buy an upgraded version of the Kasori air fryer with a basket. Um, this is the, again, Kasori air fryer dual blaze. So far, so good. Thank you everyone for watching. We'll see you next time. Ciao.